So what if the future of Indian AI began with a phone number? Puch AI has just bought India's most expensive mobile number and here it is 90909090 and yes you guessed it 90 not for vanity but as a bold statement India deserves its own AI even Shashi Tharoor is asking, are Indian investors listening? Startup launches sovereign AI on WhatsApp and calls, already serving nearly 1 million users monthly. 60% first-time AI adopters. Puch AI is building a sovereign AI platform designed to run independent of foreign influence. Why? Well, this is why. Because when Chinese models call Arunachal Pradesh South Tibet and when US labs dominate global APIs, relying on foreign AI is a sovereignty risk. Instead, Puch AI is becoming India's gateway to AI. Just like Geo was for the internet, UPI for payments and quick commerce for shopping. Their AI already works on WhatsApp and voice calls, the channels where everyday Indian lives are living and speaking. Nearly a million people use it monthly. And for 60% of them, this is their first ever AI experience. Often through local language and voice notes. Puch AI claims stronger multilingual support than Meta, better video generation than Grok, all fully self-hosted. Despite limited resources and even WhatsApp's restrictions, Puch AI is already outperforming global giants in areas that matter most for India. 22 Indic languages with natural voice note support. Celebrity AI voices on calls from Shah Rukh Khan to Sachin Tendulkar. Better video generation than Grok. And it's all self-hosted. No external APIs, no foreign servers. This isn't about competing with OpenAI, Meta or Google on model scale. It's actually about owning the distribution to a billion plus Indians. Puch AI mirrors India's technological revolutions. Geo for internet, UPI for payments, now AI for all. Conversely, Geo has something very similar, which is called Geo Phone Call AI. Meanwhile, OpenAI also launched an experimental hotline, 1-800-CHAT-GPT, accessible via WhatsApp and phone calls. But the rollout, well, limited to the United States with just 15 free minutes per month. That didn't quite catch fire in India. Siddharth Bhatia, co-founder of Puch AI, a startup making waves by buying India's most expensive phone number. I'll repeat it again for you. 90909090. Yes, 90. And positioning itself as the gateway to AI for a billion people. An ex-Googler, Siddharth has been vocal about the need for a sovereign AI stack for India. Independent, multilingual and built for everyday users, not just tech elites. Mr. Bhatia was unreachable at the time we had contacted him to join us tonight with his insights. So, we come to the question. From the streets, of small towns to the halls of parliament, Puch AI is sparking a conversation. Should India build its own AI stack just like it built UPI? Well, by turning a phone number into a national symbol, Puch AI is betting that the road to AI adoption in India won't start with flashy apps or billion dollar APIs. It will start with a simple call to, yes, you guessed it, 90, 90, 90, 
9090.